Welcome to the Balawas Safety World. Today's topic, children's playgrounds. Kids need exercise, preferably the kind they can get outdoors. Playgrounds are the perfect place for them to let off steam. But parents should keep an eye out to make sure their children's playtime doesn't result in a trip to the hospital. First of all, there's the choice of the right playground. It should be well protected from traffic, for example, by hedges or fences. The playground equipment should be stable and well anchored to the ground. To help protect against dangerous falls, the equipment shouldn't be more than two meters tall. Most falls occur when children are climbing or testing their limits on slides. Make sure the ground underneath such equipment is made of a material that can break their fall. For example, bark mulch, sand, or safety mats. You can easily tell whether the playground equipment is in good shape. Make sure there are no rotten or crumbling wooden parts and no sharp edges. Nails and splinters can also injure children. Seals of quality tell you that experts have tested the equipment. The various pieces of equipment should be far enough apart to prevent children from bumping into one another while playing. This is especially crucial for swing sets. Rotting leaves, garbage, shards of glass, and animal feces should not be found in sandboxes or other playground equipment. Heat is not an appropriate playmate. Make sure there's sufficient shade for children to play in. And finally, you should make sure your children are wearing protective clothing. Make sure they can't get hung up on cords, loops, or their bicycle helmet, for example. Explain to your children about the dangers of playground equipment. And one more thing to remember. When children are tired, they are at greater risk of injury. Thanks for watching. For more tips concerning your safety, please visit our website.